Hello and welcome, and I can tell you it was a dry walk to the gantry today, no rain in sight. I'm Derek Ray, and keeping me company here on the commentary gantry is Stuart Robson. And we've got pulsating league action coming up for you. It's Petrolul Ployest, and they take on CS Mioven. Thanks, Derek. Well, often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing, but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game. Which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question. This is the lineup for the home team. Well, it's a 4 4 2, but with a number 10 playing off the two strikers. If he can find space, pick the right passes, and at times run with the ball, he could be the match winner today. This is how the visitors will set up today. Well, they're playing in a 4-4-2, with one of the strikers just dropping that little bit deeper. His role is to find space between the defensive lines, but he can only do that if his partner makes forward runs. And the match begins. A bit of running room now on the wing. Well, high quality defending. So a throw in here. Couldn't keep it. A long way out. Well, it wasn't quite the quality of shot that we were all anticipating. And showing fine vision. Great strong tackle. Throw in forthcoming. Diomande. Jefferson. He has teammates around him. Can they take advantage? And that was simply miles off target. Well, I think he's right to go for power, but he's made the wrong connection, and it's really poor technique in the end. of challenge put in oh that's a really good run will he play it in a deft clearance An astute piece of defending. Seto. Ismael Diomande. Oh, nice ball over the top. In behind for him to chase. So there goes the half time whistle, and it is a story of parity. Stuart, what have you made of the visitors' display? Yeah, their defending has been good today. Such an improvement. And for me, the difference has been the centre-backs. They've made all the right decisions. Hopefully that continues in the... No-nonsense clearance. Well, the fans really want him to shoot. Not really the ideal clearance. Oh, it's gone in! 
And that will be written down as an own goal. No wonder he's hanging his head. Well, here it is again, and quite clearly that's an own goal. He's a bit unfortunate, really. One nil then. And plenty of scope to be creative in that wide position. And players waiting in the centre. And it wasn't taxing for the keeper. Well, the stats tell you everything. The chances have been few and far between, and they haven't tested the goalkeeper anywhere near enough. If they want to get something from this game, they're going to have to improve in the final third. And they still don't have the ball. That has been a recurring theme. Well, not the pass he had in mind. And the upshot of that is offside. Well, he needed to look elsewhere because the flag was always going to go up. And with play stop, they will make the change now. Snow. Oh, they have it again. Take some progress with the ball at his feet. The clearance wasn't decisive. Well, threat about it. And the goalkeeper under no pressure. Well, he's given us away. Now we're inside the final quarter of an hour now. And the counter attack is on, options available. And he's through here. Oh, crucial tackle. Brilliant. And given away. Couldn't keep it. Well, they're attacking, but time is the great enemy. That's not a bad ball. Not away completely. Well, the keeper does his job. Well, nice idea, but he didn't quite get enough on it, did he? And that is the end of the contest, and not a happy outcome as far as the visitors are concerned. Well, Derek, it was a hard-fought contest, which neither side completely dominated, but the result will certainly hurt them. They need to bounce back next time out.